These are tears of jubilation and relief for the people of Makini in rural Mape Finchafen district. They are wailing louder as they see local MP Rainbow Paita driving the first ever vehicle to reach the village. Since PNG gained political independence, this is also the first road into the area as emotionally told by a village elder while embracing Paita. <laughs> He come long, 16, 2016. He no looks at all of me. I mean, can you give me your time? He inhuman. He no man, big dog, and he give me. That's so bad. God, he put up long head for long and put up long for long and put up long, long for long and put up long moon for long and now, I mean, right in the cover. He independent to be kissing now. On the 11th of February, Paita drove from Gagidu Station to Makini. On the way, they caught up with the bulldozer still cutting the new road. About 50 meters before reaching Makini. It took 10 days, day and night, to cut through this near impossible mountainous region from the nearest road link at Zinko, about a few hours' walk from Makini. With the help of a chainsaw, trees falling over the road were cleared as the bulldozer continued to cut through. Arriving at Makini, even the sight of the bulldozer finally arriving at the village broke hearts. For those who didn't dare to venture out of the village to challenge the rough and thick jungle terrain to Gagidu Station, it is the first time to see an actual bulldozer and a vehicle. For adults, they finally have an easy access to Gagidu Station, the main township of Finchafen District. No more jungle walks that often take a day or two. The old fellow likened Paita to the late Grand Chief Sir Michael Samare, bringing independence to the people of Makini. Me not the boss. Now me shall not be talking you. Me not be giving you number. Proof what that be new we give you. I don't understand. Now court I give you a minute shabby. My pet in the I think one or two. Now you come on that. The village road development program will continue on to Bokesu and to Nandua connecting a ring road. The long-term plan is to connect the road to Saido in Medeng province. While this mother's cry in jubilation, other mothers in many rural areas in PNG are still cut off from the main stations and continue to cry in vain for such development to reach them. Shamin Poreambeb, National MTV News.